Thousands of demonstrators in more than 400 cities across the country, including right here in Richmond, gathered for the March for Our Lives today. They're hoping to pressure Congress to pass stricter gun legislation. One of the biggest rallies in Washington, D.C. drew crowds of over 40,000 people. Around 100 people gathered on Monument Avenue in Richmond, demanding gun control legislation. The first March for Our Lives took place in 2018, after the massacre at Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School that's in Parkland, Florida. The latest rallies come after two high-profile mass shootings at a Buffalo grocery store and a Texas elementary school. Demonstrators calling on Congress to increase the age requirement to buy semi-automatic weapons and pass a national red flag law. Too many people are dying needlessly. And, and what's even being proposed in the House and Senate is marginal. I mean, it's, it's important, but it's not all that needs to be done. This week, the Democratic House passed a series of gun control measures. They are not expected to pass the evenly divided Senate, but negotiations continue on a more narrow set of reforms.